coming up. Another episode of A Weekly Dose of Volume, the only show that descends into the heavy underground. I can hear you right now. Elder, what are you listening to? What's that awesome music? Well, I will tell. This is the new Kalel. Moon People, out today on Majestic Mountain Records, and it's fucking fantastic. People is out today on Majestic Mountain Records. Let's see what other vibrations have made it onto this week's heavy underground news. Ripple Fest Texas has kicked off over in Austin, Texas, which boasts a killer lineup including Brand Bjork, The Well, King Buffalo, Thunder Horse, Duel, Unida, Telekinetic Yeti, Nick Oliveri, and Sasquatch to name but a few. Daily Thompson, Mars Red Sky, and Hippie Death Cult have all announced European tours to close the year. Check out your nearest venue and grab those tickets now, folks. And the new Baroness album Stone has been out for a week now. Baroness are a band that have consistently sought to create depth in their work. Being so outright avant-garde has always been the appeal of Baroness to their fans. This is heavy music for those who seek more substance and meaning than just good riffs and a shot of Jaeger. Once again, John Baisley acts as the lightning rod through which all that is Baroness flows, taking creative lead as is Baroness norm across the album's theme, artwork, music and direction. a challenging listen at times, but it is that way by intention, lest we forget this is art after all. Truly immersive art. With each Baroness record the listener is forced to face the same conundrum. I am a fan. Am I a fan of this? Baisley is just creating his art after all. What it means to him and why he made it remains with him. But as an artist he has created something where there was nothing and leaves it to you. The listener, the fan, the critic to make what sense of it you wish. And don't worry if Baroness is not your cup of tea. That's why we have fucking Red Fang. Yeah. Now last week as I was flipping through all the vinyl for the vinyl giveaway prize, I came across one of our next releases, Purple Kong, Blood Lightning. Well, to whet your appetite, the London-based proto-metalers have released a video to accompany the title track. Check it out. Purple Kong Blood Lightning is out on Cosmic Artifacts October 13th on this limited edition Red and Black Splatter Disc. Fuck yes. Now I have been bursting at the seams to tell you about this next band. I shit you not. I spun this record for less than 10 seconds before I was calling up the guys at Cosmic to draw me up a contract. Sit tight, my beautiful disciples. This is fuzzy grass. Yes, 
it has been so long since a band has made me this happy. I mean, just listen to that. <laughs> yes! Behold, Fuzzy Grass, your new favorite band. Uh, thank you. <laughs> These French rockers don't just hit the nail on the head when it comes to that classic 70s vintage sound. They genuinely ooze it from every fucking pore. I mean, let's just take a moment to appreciate that guitar mastery from Laura Louise. A soul that could go chop to chops with a certain Hendrix, and does so throughout this record. Every member of Fuzzy Grass is as skilled and godly gifted as the next, with a rock star's name to boot. I mean, check out this pan thumping, yeah. I mean, you've got it all here, that unrelenting guitar work, that tight as a duck's arse rhythm section between Thomas Hovec and Clément Godre San Diego. That <laughs> I told you about the names. But then you have moments like this where vocalist, organ player, and synth master Audric Fouchot. For sure, his name is for sure. Like, like for sure, like for sure, my man. Audric for sure. I mean, even with the French accent, Audric for sure is a kick-ass name. <laughs> they really do have it all. Anyway, for sure, commands throughout. At times, bringing that vintage Jagger swagger. At others embodying the very soul of Jim Morrison himself. Anyway, I could rant and breathe about this record all day long. It is simply sublime, and so I am very, 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 very glad that we have it out on this as the world desperately needs to take a long, deep inhale on some fuzzy grass. Which is why this week's goes to fuzzy grass. The Revenge of the Blue Nuts is out October 6th on Cosmic Artifacts. Limited edition, baby blue and white marbled vinyl edition. Pre-order your copy today. Until next week, my friends. Keep it loud. Keep it heavy. Keep it cosmic. Excuse me. I'm still beast. Am I fooling? Am I crazy? Just